Good evening ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to our favourite car crash that is FIFA 22. I'm doing a video because of one reason, one reason only, is that EA's f***ed up, people are stupid and I find it quite funny. As of right now EA are going through thousands upon thousands of accounts, most of them are being banned, suspended, for the most simplest mistake I have ever seen that EA could have ever made. It's actually stupid. The cheapest and most reliable coins on the market. Go down to u7buy.com. Link is down below in the description. And make sure to use code VISA at checkout for 5% off. Now, of course, I don't do many videos actually on about the game. You know, nowadays, I talk about other things that I find interesting. However, I've seen this in the last couple of hours. And I felt like I had to talk about it. Because if it feels like it's just a thing that I just talk about. I'm known as like, the guy that like, yo, when the time comes, I'll just give EA a bit of a, just a bit of a slap. Just a bit of a, you know, a kick up the arse. Just like, what's going on here? If you don't know what's happened in the last 24 hours, basically, EA have completely ruined rewards. Yesterday, I saw a bunch of tweets flying around looking like this, saying there's an exploit on with Rivals Rewards. Apparently, you could get your rewards over and over and over again when you open them in the web app and says wouldn't do this we've seen previously that accounts will be banned what do people do when you give them never ending packs and coins of course they're going to f***ing exploit it it took EA an entire day to actually like mention this and say what's going on and I believe even stop what's going on. We have identified active accounts that consistently exploited Div Rivals Awards early this week, which is so stupid. It took them like two days to even talk about it. Never have I seen this in five years of the your foot champions and rivals or seasons. Like I've never seen this happen. How do EA somehow keep on pushing themselves to f things up even more. I've never seen this happen where you literally can just refresh your page after you've already opened your rewards just to get more rewards. This has never happened. This has never happened. At times you've had things like your know, red picks don't show up correctly, things like that. Sometimes they don't give you the right amount of packs. I've never seen this. So when you give a community that EA have basically force fed packs upon packs upon packs, turning FIFA into a slot machine where basically the only thing that people care about are packs and SBCs when you give people the opportunity just to get non-stop forever packs and coins, of course they go on to exploit it. And that's exactly what happened. F***ing everyone did it. And it says that as a punishment, the people that have done it, they will suspend them for seven days. Personally, I would say that's really lenient. But then it says down below, for people that is severely exploited the Div Ravs rewards, it says these accounts have received the aforementioned suspension of seven days, but alongside that, they will no longer be able to access the transfer market. And I know you're thinking, and let me just reply back to the top comment here by Kieran saying you're suspending them for your mistake. Yes. Of course, they're not forcing to exploit it. Of course, if you exploit a thing in the game, even if it is EA's fault, if you exploit the game and you go out of your way to have glitches, especially glitches, which is this devastating because it basically gives you unlimited packs and coins for several, several hours. If you do that, then of course, you're going to be f***ing banned, you idiot. Of course you will be. I don't, I, what do people spare? Oh, yeah, sorry, it's our fault. We're just giving, like, you know, thousands of people in the community millions of coins. Just have a slap in the wrist and go for seven days. Then go buy a bunch of Arnhem and Aldos. Of course, they're going to be banned. Just to keep in mind how dumb this is, if you're in like Div 5, Div 4 or something, and like it may not be as severe, but if you are an elite, you know, Div Rivals player, this is what's happened. Praetorian, he saw on Twitch a guy that did the glitch 90 times in one morning. He chose option 3 90 times. That is 90 red picks, 92 red gold players, 90 50k packs, 90 100k packs, and 3.6 million coins of f course if you are doing this then you are banned simple as that now, the one thing that i find confusing is that there's people which has received this message there's several several people this is just two samples that i've got and it says that your account has been disabled and that you can't access to put it again for a thousand days for 1,000 days. I think that's a bit different to seven days, lads. Dylan says, I did it once by accident. This is a joke. I've spent lots of money in the game, and because of something you have done yourself, I'm getting punished. And he has been suspended for 1,000 days. I can kind of believe it if it's a one case. I can kind of believe that. And the response I find is hilarious. You guys are unreal. Here are three packs in which you've done nothing wrong in obtaining. We're giving them to you thanks of... 
We're giving them to you thanks to our sheer incompetence. Oh, and I just keep claiming these thanks EA. Um, no, that is naughty get banned. EA Sports is in the broken game. The thing is, though, it says for severely exploited accounts. If you did it like a couple of times, then I don't think that you'd be done. Like seven days banned. That's a slap in the wrist. If anything, that's a gift. It's a gift to be banned for seven days off this game. The thing is, do we really trust EA to actually ban the right people? Because I feel like there'd be someone that has done it only once and has been banned off the market. That's the thing. We can't actually tell who got banned. And this is the best response that really matches my eyes out of it, saying, I get it, it's EA's mistake, but the imbalance this causes is massive. I didn't win enough this week, so it's irrelevant anyway, but people who did and open it on the real game ends up getting punished. If you open your rewards once, like normal, and other people open it fucking 100 times, they could have two, three, four million coins on you, and you're there doing the thing the right way. I don't get these fucking idiots that think that they shouldn't be punished for this. All you lot calling for reward glitches to be banned, just admit you're so that you didn't get loads of free packs, no one should be banned for EA's mistake. I mean, I don't even play the game, but if you exploit something, then that's just how it is. Honestly, who cares? I would have refreshed four, five, six times if it let me, whose fault is that EA? So you can just take the coins they made back, but a ban, that's just way too far. But how can you take coins back if people spent their coins? Which, I presume... A lot of people did. If you say from a sample 1 million coins, you're probably gonna spend that million coins, which majority of people probably have, so how do you take the coins away from them? For some cases, maybe, but it can't be consistent. Player, cheats, EA, bans cheater, player, why would EA do this? And people trying to use an example of like, oh yeah, but EA gave you it, like, it's a gift, they say like, you're claiming your rewards, or in fact, EA are giving you them. You've got to be an idiot if you actually believe that, because it says claim your rewards. The first, second, third, or fourth, fourth time, okay, I can maybe get what's going on. If you do it, 50 times, you know what you're doing. Don't act f***ing dumb. This is why I cannot play this game anymore. I can't play this game because I cannot take it f***ing serious. It's impossible. It's just unrelenting, just annoyance because nothing in this game makes any sense. This happens several times a year. Several times a year, there's some mad glitch like this that basically like half the community, it feels like, just gets a massive advantage. Because of EA's mistake, it is EA's mistake, but it still makes it stupid. I'll show you my team here. It, again, it's not changed. It, it's not changed at all. Ever since my video back in like November with me getting Red Mbappe, I've played the game 39 times. So that is what's happening with the FIFA. It's a, it's a complete utter mess, which you probably already expected. Tell me your thoughts down below. I mean, do you disagree with me? I, I, I don't know how you can. The only people that I feel bad for is that if you've done it like literally like less than five times and you got severely banned for it. If you got like the, the thousand days or if you got like a transfer ban, then I feel like that's a bit hard. But if you severely exploited it like 10 plus times, then like I don't know how you can see that. I don't know how you can not expect something to happen from that. I think you're just playing dumb at that stage. Tell me your thoughts down below and I will see you guys for another video. I just wanted to talk about this. I, I it, FIFA is like a, a car crash that I cannot look away from sometimes. I'll see you guys next time. Stay safe.